Otto Top Bill and his best friend Corby up on the hill. Let's watch them as they play. of Bottle Top Bill. And his best friend, Corky. Bottle Top Bill. What sort of an adventure will we have today, Bill? A real beauty, Corky. It's called The Tall Story. Where exactly are we, Bill? Don't you recognise it? It looks a little like... I know! It's Cedric the Scientist's laboratory. Spot on, Corky. And he wants our help with his new project. Fantastic! I wonder where Cedric is? He should be around here somewhere. There he is! Hello, Cedric. Good morning, good morning. It is a good morning, Cedric. How are you today? Very well, thank you. And I'm even better now that you're here to help me. Let's go outside to my new truck. Can we go for a ride in it? Better than that, I want you to drive it. I have an important delivery for you to make. No problem, Cedric. We can deliver this truck anywhere you like. It's not the truck that needs delivering. It's what's in the truck. What is in the truck? It's very tall. It's got very long, long legs. And a very long, long neck. And it's yellow. With brown patches. It's, it's a, a giraffe. giraffe. Paint me pink. It's the first giraffe I've ever seen. Stretchy needs to be taken to her new home. Leave it to us, Cedric. We'll get her there nice and safely. Here's a book on giraffes that will tell you everything you need to know. Now, where's my tricycle? What do you need that for, Cedric? I have to go on ahead and make sure Stretchy's new home is ready for her. So many things to do, so little time to do them. That's very nice whistling, Corky. I'm not whistling, Bill. And I'm not whistling either. So who is whistling? It's Stretchy. Bill, this book says that giraffes sometimes talk to each other by whistling. Crikey, giraffes must be very clever. I think it's time we got going, Bill. Ready, Corky? Ready, Bill. Are you ready, Stretchy? Then let's get cracking. Our friends will get an incredible surprise when they see Stretchy. You said it, Corky. It's not every day you see a giraffe go by. I can't wait to see the look on Maisie the cow. And I can't wait to see what Mrs Whistlehead Sheep think of Stretchy. Hello, Maisie. <coughs> Hello, Sheep. <coughs> mm. Look, Bill, who's that ahead? He looks very familiar, Corky. I think I know who it is. So do I. It's our friend Ned. Just wait till he sees what we've got on board. Beep, beep. Wow, a giraffe. Sorry, Ned, can't stop. We have to get Stretchy to her new home. Bill, Corky, wait for me. We'll be at Stretchy's new home in no time, Corky. Uh, Bill? This truck is really nice to drive, Corky. But, Bill? I wonder if Cedric wants us to deliver more animals. That would be great. Bill, look! What is it, Corky? I'm not sure, Bill, but I think it's going to be a problem. It's an overhead bridge, and it will be a very big problem. Oh, oh. What do you think, Bill? I think Stretchy is too tall to fit under the bridge. I think so too, Bill. What are we going to do? Wow! It really is a giraffe. And her name is Stretchy, Ned. Can I come with you and Stretchy? Please, Bill? Please, Corky? No problems, Ned. You can come with us. As long as you don't touch anything. But what do we do about our problem? We can't go under the bridge, Bill. So we'll have to take the long way around. The long way it is. The long way around is going to be bumpy. 
very bumpy. Sorry for the bumpy ride, Stretchy. Mm, I don't like the look of that rock, Bill. What rock, Corky? The rock we're about to hit. Whoa! I think we've got a flat tyre, Bill. We do have a flat tyre, Corky. We'll need to change it. And to do that, we need a jack to lift the truck. But we don't have one. But we are close to Mrs Whistlehead's farm. She might have one. Ned, could you look after Stretchy while we visit Mrs Whistlehead? You bet. I'd love to look after Stretchy. Let's go, Corky. On our way, Bill. Wow. I love giraffes. Could I please pat you, Stretchy? Thank you. I can't reach. I've got to get higher. This ladder will do it. Now I can reach. Wow. I'm patting a giraffe. This is the best! Uh-oh. I've touched something. Please, Stretchy, be a good giraffe. Now, Stretchy, you be a good giraffe and hop back into the truck. Stretchy, come back! Stretchy! Stretchy! Maisie, sheep, did you see a giraffe go by? Mm. Thank you. Stop, Stretchy. Please stop. It's so nice of Mrs Whistlehead to lend us this jack, Corky. You said it, Bill. We'll have this wheel changed in no time. Uh, Bill. Cedric will be very grateful that we've gone to all this trouble. But, Bill. There it is. Good as new. Bill, look. I don't believe it. Where's Stretchy? And where's Ned? We've got to find them, Corky. I think we'll need our helicopter for this. That's what I was thinking too, Corky. Stretchy could be anywhere. It could take ages to find her. Up, Bill. Up, Corky. And away. Maybe Stretchy wandered off because she's hungry. My giraffe book says that they eat the leaves of trees. Down there, Corky. Do you see it? I do, Bill. A big, leafy tree. If I was a giraffe, I'd think that was a very yummy tree. Look, Bill. It's Stretchy. And she does think it's a yummy tree. Stop, Stretchy. Oh, you have stopped. Bill! Corky! Thank goodness you're here. Stretchy escaped. How did she get out of the truck? I might have touched something. I didn't mean to. Ned, you should be more careful. I'm really sorry. Honest. Never mind. We just have to get Stretchy to follow us to a new home. How will you do that, Bill? That's easy. You just... Uh, Corky, how will we get Stretchy to follow us? I don't know, Bill. Maybe Cedric's book can tell us. It says that giraffes like to be with their giraffe friends and they like to follow each other. So we need another giraffe to lead Stretchy to her new home. <gasps> wow, two giraffes! But where do we find another giraffe? Here's an idea, Bill. If we can't find another giraffe, we can make one. Now you're talking, Corky. We can make a mechanical giraffe. With long legs. And a tall neck. A small head with two little horns. And don't forget the tail. That's the best looking mechanical giraffe I've ever seen. Not that I've ever seen one until now. We have everything inside that we need to control our mechanical giraffe. Ready, Corky? Ready, Bill. Forward giraffe. Let's hope that we can get Stretchy to follow us to a new home. Ready for our whistle, Corky? Ready, Bill. It's working, Bill. Like a dream, Corky. I can see Stretchy's new home up ahead, Bill. Spot on, Corky. That's the animal park. Are we nearly there? Not far now, Corky. Bill and Corky are late. What could be keeping them? What indeed? 
Wonderful! I'm so happy to see you, Stretchy. But where's my truck? And who is that other giraffe? Oh, this is a great control room. What does this button do? Ned, don't touch anything. I won't. Promise? Really, truly. Look, I'll step right away. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Ned touched something. Whoa! I've never seen a giraffe hop before. What a strange giraffe. Strange indeed. Hang on, Corky. Hang on, Ned. Whoa! What a ride. You said it, Bill. It's Bill and Corky. And Ned, too. And this is a mechanical giraffe. Ingenious. We had a problem or two, Cedric. But we finally got Stretchy to her new home. Thank you so much. Now I should take Stretchy in so she can meet all her new friends. Can I come and meet all the animals, Cedric? Please do, Ned. But, but Ned... Ned... I know. I won't touch anything. Goodbye, Stretchy. Whew. I knew we'd be having an adventure today, Corky, but I didn't think it would turn out like this. Still, it was a great adventure, Bill. It sure was. And a great adventure is one of the best things ever. <laughs> when you're right, Corky, you're right. <laughs>